from Alberta, Canada. Welcome to another travel vlog. Today is Monday, May 16th, and this week we are spending the next five days in Alberta, Canada. On Saturday morning, Lucas and I flew from Boston over to Seattle to spend a weekend layover with family. We had some much needed family bonding. Last night, we dropped off Sherbert over at my brother's because he will be watching him for the week. Today, we are spending the day in Calgary. We just flew into the Calgary airport around 2 p.m., and now we are back at the hotel, just kind of resting and recharging before we meet up with more family. We'll actually be seeing a lot of family members throughout the week. We'll be spending time in Calgary, Banff, as well as Edmonton. We are very excited to see some new sites, but we are extra excited to see family along the way too. As always, we will bring you guys along as we explore Alberta, Canada for the very first time. of our Alberta Canada adventure. Today is our first full day here in Canada. It is Tuesday and today's agenda is to drive over to Banff National Park. It is about an hour and a half drive from Calgary and so we're going to spend two nights and three days over in Banff. So the weather is looking a little cloudy, maybe even a little rainy, but we'll see what we can get. It is going to be much colder so we are dressed for the occasion. Quick check-in from last night. We met up with my Aunt Rose, my Uncle Mike, and my cousin Tim. As you guys saw through the b-roll, we kind of walked around downtown Calgary. I believe it's like the Bow River Parkway and we walked over to the Peace Bridge just for some pictures and just for a nice sunny walk. The weather in Calgary is much warmer than it's going to be in Banff so we soaked in the sun when we could and then for dinner we ate at Nando's. What they're famous for is like their peri-peri chicken and it was amazing. We had some sharing platters but I also had the pulled pork feta and avocado bowl. 10 out of 10. This morning we checked out of our hotel in Calgary so we could drive over to Banff. So as always we will bring you guys along. Banff National Park. We just checked into our hotel. We are staying at the Fox Hotel and Suites in downtown Banff. We couldn't check in until about 3 p.m. this afternoon, so this morning we went over to White Bark Cafe to grab a coffee. Lucas got a cappuccino, I got a latte, and my dad got a black coffee as well as like a pork sausage roll. 10 out of 10 at White Bark Cafe. I think we might go there again tomorrow morning, depending on what the breakfast situation looks like here at the Fox Hotel and Suites. After we got a quick pick-me-up after the long drive, we drove over to Lake Louise. We pretty much spent a couple hours just kind of walking around the frozen lake. The mountains were absolutely beautiful and it was so great just to be able just to take in the views. It was actually supposed to rain today but luckily it didn't and it actually kind of warmed up around like 1 or 2 p.m. So we were able to get some awesome pictures and some videos. After Lake Louise we ended up just driving back into downtown Banff to see if we could check in early which we were able to and so now we're just kind of taking an hour to reach our our phones, warm up, kind of rest a bit before we wander back into downtown to find some dinner. So far we are loving Banff National Park. Luckily the weather has been holding out at least for today. There's still rain predicted for tomorrow so we're gonna try and see if we can enjoy Banff as much as we can while it's still dry. We'll bring you guys along. It is day three of our Alberta adventure. This morning we're starting off the day with complimentary breakfast at our hotel. It's actually down at the Chili's restaurant. And then later this morning, Lucas and I will be riding the Banff gondola.
morning. It is day four of our Alberta adventure. So it is our third day in Banff. We're actually checking out of our hotel today. Lucas and I actually took a dip in the spa pool this morning. And so that's why my hair is up, but we are getting ready to check out at 11 a.m. because we will be driving over to Edmonton to go visit my godmother and her family. So that's kind of the plan for today. I forgot to check in yesterday, but the gondola was so much fun. Lucas and I went ahead of my parents just because my mom was a little scared of riding the gondola. <laughs> Can I say that? She doesn't like heights. And so she actually did not ride the gondola with us yesterday, but I'm glad that Lucas and I did it. To get to the gondola, Lucas and I took the Rome public transit bus, which was great. It's actually included with our hotel here at Fox Hotel and Suites. So I'm gonna jump in the shower and then we have a four hour drive ahead of us to drive to West Edmonton Mall. Morning. It is day five of our Alberta adventure. We made it to West Edmonton last night, but I didn't get a chance to vlog because we were just swept away by my family touring us around the mall and having a ton of fun. And so this morning is Friday and I wanted to take a chance to just check in and let you guys know what we did. As you guys saw from the clips and from the beautiful background behind me, my godmother booked us a hotel at Fantasyland Hotel. It's amazing. She booked us the Polynesian Hotel. It literally comes with like a jetted hot tub in your room. So we definitely used that last night. I've never stayed at a hotel like this. So we are feeling really blessed that she booked this for us. This is where we stayed. It's in West Edmonton Mall. And if you didn't know, West Edmonton Mall is the biggest mall in North America, I think. It's huge. It has a water park, movie theater, bowling alley, casino, amusement park. Like it has it all, literally. And so last night when we got to the hotel, we were swept away because a lot of the stuff closed by like 5 p.m. or so. My cousins, Ate Marielle and Travis kind of toured us around along with my godmother Ninang Baby and we just kind of got to take in West Edmonton Mall for all that it offers. There was a lot but it was a lot of fun getting to see everything. After dinner we went to Glow in the Dark Golf which I've never done before and it was a lot of fun. It got kind of competitive but that's what kind of made it fun and then after that we went to the arcade, played some games and then we also went to the casino, played some slots and then we ended the evening just taking pictures over by like the big boats and all the scenic spots in the mall but what was really cool is that it was completely empty and then we ended the evening right there <laughs> It was nice to just kind of bond with our cousins and my godmother. This morning, we just kind of packed up and got ready. And now we're going to go meet up with Clea Calvin. So that's my other cousin. He's the eldest. We're going to go over to his house for like a, like a brunch. And then we'll be driving another three hours back over to Calgary. So we have a lot still in store, even though it is our last full day here in Alberta. As always, we'll bring you guys along. Mm -hmm. 